begins. Because that, that exists. That's a thing. Okay, 3-4 of the states. Board, go. Attacks ambassador. Rabble. Okay, beggar doesn't defend against either of these trashing. You've got ambassador and forge and remake. All the trashing. Okay, so uh, we care about draw. You've got shanty town and nobles as terrible villages. Rabble for draw. Uh, is there a plus by contraband? And there's forage for gains. Yeah, yeah. well, ambassador wars everything. So do you open... Uh, what do you open? Double Ambassador, Ambassador Remake, Ambassador Shantytown. Uh, Ambassador Remake seems very good. You, you can gain lots of three cards. Uh, so yeah. You'll want the Shantytowns eventually. And Silver's not the worst thing ever to have, because you want to get up to Ravel and Nobles, I guess. Although you also don't want to lose the Ambassador War. But losing the Ambassador War is, uh, you know... best done by not building this thing because this thing once it's built is going to just pummel the opponent into nothing and then they resign that's how the game ends your opponent resigns so do i want two three cost cards right now or do i want to give him an estate so there's a there's a five and seven there's a two and seven chance that I hit five next turn. If that happens, I'll wish I had a shanty town in my deck because I'm buying a rabble, which makes me want to play remake. Then I would get two shanty towns. Hashtag doing it. Okay, he does a similar thing, only he doesn't get his rabble, he returns coppers. Oh, well, this shanty town's looking real good right now, I gotta tell ya. certainly worked out for him. Now I'm going to draw a dead shanty town. Well, that's how you know you made the wrong choice, isn't it? Okay, well this is a hand. I can do something with this. Uh, I have the only estate in the world, and it's going to become a $3 card. Sad nobles is sad. Uh, and Adam is sad because he really should be returning coppers here. Well, I've got more good cards and I think I have more bad cards too. Whatever card I draw off, this is going to be important. I really hope it's a rabble or a nobles. It's not. Uh, that's fine. I'll get this. And we need to prioritize getting uh, more shanty towns, which this is an estate, so I will be able to do. Okay, good draw. I think there's another shanty in here, isn't there? So I could be. In oh, never mind. Deck tracking went to crap because Rabble exists. Just draw me something that draws cards. That's all I want, deck. Huh. Thinking. What are those last two cards? I bet you they're both copper. No, one of them's a rabble. So probably copper and rabble. He has three silvers. 
and I have seven coppers and I can draw them. I think I just want to get a nobles and chuck him a copper. Um, Eh, seems okay. Let's do that. Wow, that's a hand. So he can draw his deck. He must have zero coppers. 51. He probably has like two coppers, right? He has a scavenger. I totally missed him getting that. Okay, I need to thin then. Easiest way to lose this game right now is to not thin and then get snowballed. Okay, I don't want to be playing my nobles for actions. This is actually a really bad draw, but let's... It's just thin. This, I think, is a shanty town, but that doesn't matter. Hey, I was right, though. That matters. So, I want to get some economy that's not bad. Contraband is uh, a consideration. I also want to get lots of nobles and stuff. I mean, once I feel comfortable with drawing my deck reliably... Then I can get some more payload. Uh, what, what are you going to do here? All the options with Remake, you know. Uh, that last card, I think, is a copper. It's a copper. Yeah, Remake doesn't seem all that good. I might have, like, remade a rabble into a nobles or something, but it's too late for that. Oh, wait, that last card is my other nobles, so I definitely want to top deck that. If I remake the shantytown into a scavenger, I have more economy. That seems really bad, though. I don't feel comfortable remaking the ambassador. Contraband would be kind of nice. Man, what do I do? I don't know. Um, going all in on Ambassador seems pretty bad. He's He's got a remake in an Ambassador. I think we can both somewhat reliably keep thin. So I guess I should focus on Payload. Maybe I should remake the Ambassador. Yeah, but I can't remake it into anything all that fantastic. Might as well keep pelting him with stuff. So I guess I'm just going to get a rabble this turn. Chuck him a copper. Maybe I can remake rabbles into nobles. I just don't know where this game's going to go. I, I just want a lot of good cards. I also only have $5 of economy in my deck, so I have to think about that. McSenox says, you have plenty of draw, you need some money. I feel like I have barely enough draw. Oh man, 
I guess th I mean, these are both rabbles. Do I get a gold? Do I get a contraband? Contraband's probably fine because of remake. I wish I'd... I mean, I, I'd like to be drawing more for that. Yeah, let's get a contraband. It's fun. There you go. for you. <laughs> Shantytown is <laughs> awkward. He's going to know exactly what's in my hand. I find that amusing, but I think that's also okay. Oh, nasty. Good luck figuring out what to proscribe. The nice thing is I don't super care. There are plenty of good things to get. More shanty towns would be fine. More nobles would be fine. He can't ban them both. Chess piece face says hello. Hi, chess piece face. I think we're just gonna get the two things that I said I liked. He should block shanties. Yeah, well, if he knew, if he knows I have nine dollars, which he technically could know, then I mean that's just a buy that's getting flushed down the toilet. But if he thought I had eight, you know, maybe he wanted to block the rabble. Yeah, I don't know, I think still blocking shanty towns is probably good there, yeah. I mean, luckily I don't have to make the decision, so I just don't have to think about it. So he wants to win the noble split. What I'd really like to do is remake into nobles this turn, so he can't block it. Okay. Can I draw some good stuff? Never. Never ever. I could remake the contraband into nobles. Buy it back. I actually kind of like that. It guarantees me the nobles. Takes away some options from him because, uh, you know, he can't have a points lead. Uh, without rabbles hurting him potentially. Yep. I think I like this. I still feel like I'm not drawing enough. You are also rewarded for overdraw. You can gain and play stuff. Like, if he got another ambassador, I would legitimately be worried. But I am I am turning down opportunities to thin, like, every turn, so I can buy things. So it's really not that bad. I think Forge is a good card. I should probably get one. It's more gains. So more pile control. Also a really easy way to uh, get points, yeah, without having to buy it. My copper still comes from coppers, and my economy still comes from coppers and contrabands, so like getting golds at some point would probably also be good.
Shantytown is a great remake target. The fours are all terminals, though. So he gets a gold. Okay. Okay, I think I'm happy with this so far, and now I'm no longer happy with this. Forge. Oh, Forge is a great remake target. You are correct. Uh, unfortunately, I can't. Unfortunately, I can't get one this turn. Eh. Remake Rabble into gold. Not buy anything good this turn. Sounds pretty bad. Nah, buy a shanty town. That's probably fine. Thin a copper. Nah, I like it. Mixinoc wanted me to ambassador coppers. Uh, he's going to draw the crap out of his deck this turn. Is he just going to go for single province? I think I should be able to shut him down if he does that. Get more ambassadors. Is he going to be able to draw that contraband? He trashes his ambassador. Okay. So he's got three silvers and a gold. I think I just don't want him to have forge. He'll load up on golds. Maybe if I deny golds. I should probably deny gold. Oh, I do need to eat lunch. <laughs> Sometimes I forget to eat. I thought you had another silver. What's this last card? Can I, like, draw my deck this turn, maybe? Never. Never, ever. That should never happen. Drawing your deck is super lame. You should never do it. Uh, piles are low. What are those last two cars? A rabble and a thing? Jirajzard says nobles and then unfortunate face. Wow, province was the last thing on my mind. I think I just want to forge. Yeah, I want it. Nobles for other last card. All my nobles were in play. Yeah, point tracker is a good way to keep track of the noble split. So this is his hand. He's thinking about playing a remake and then nobles. Ah, gets the contraband out. He wants to go for single province, huh? 
well, we need to punish him for that. Province and duchy. How strongly do I feel that I can lock him down before he can empty piles? I think that last card's a rabble. Did my rabble... No, it skipped three things. He has no more $4 cards in his deck, so like he's hardcore committed to single province turns. I could forge Ambassador and Contraband into province by a Fiver, probably a Rabble, be a forge target. I'd still like to be able to buy provinces. Uh, racing for green just feels like a losing proposition. He should be able to single province until the end of time, unless I shut him down. So I think I have to shut him down, yeah. Forge contraband into rabble by rabble? No, because he just empties piles. I can't have any more rabbles, so it's going to be hard to shut him down. I need to junk him heavily with Ambassador. Arr. He's got more, he's got better economy than me and a lot of draw. So he's in a great spot. How do I win from here? Do I win by shutting him down? I think I win by shutting him. Oh, no, he can't empty. No, no, I win by shutting him down. Whew. I've got a forge. Ah, uh, what do I do? <laughs> Does he even have an ambassador left? No. He's got like a remake. Uh, I should just race him on green. I don't know. This could be totally wrong. And this is really working out for him. Wow, this draw is amazing for him. 
he had a bad hand, and somehow he drew out of it by drawing with his shanty town. Ugh. he remaking gold into forge okay what else is he remaking he can't have any pleasant options remake I guess because of Forge and Remake, getting thin and overdrawing had more value than uh, having good cards in your deck. And so early on when I made my priorities like that, I think that's when I lost this game. Because like this position is so bad, his position is so good. <laughs> he says this game is so hard, it's true, but I think he just played it better. I think he just outplayed me. I think it's that simple. know what to do here. Play for him to stall, and for me not to stall. The problem is I don't have a forge anymore. I can't double province. <laughs> uh, I mean, I guess I, I technically could. I can remake into forge and play the forge but I give up a gold for that and I can rabble into gold I just yeah, maybe that was still best I did drop some frames in there. Sorry. Uh, well, this is a big decision here. I can just YOLO and buy a province. Hope he does again. What are the odds of that? He had a clean shuffle, I imagine. And he played nobles, nobles, rabble. So, he had eight cards in his hand. Let's assume he drew three dead actions, and he had a bunch of green. He still had a bunch of green, right? He had like three greens. I only top decked one of them. Skipped a bunch. Uh... He has an estate on his deck. I've skipped even more of his treasure. 
Um, okay. Other option, remake gold into forge, shantytown into, I don't know, remake and buy a duchy. That seems really sad. But I can remake the duchy if I need province options. It, it, it does cost five, so the duchy's actually not terrible. I lose a shanty town, which isn't a big deal. And what do I top deck? What are, what are those two cards on the top of my deck? Uh, they're both nobles. Oh, that's great, actually. <sighs> well, both the options seem better than where I was two turns ago. So that's good. I've topped like two nobles, which means I have a decent chance of kicking off next turn. So that that pushes me less towards YOLO. With the remake and the forge in my deck next turn, I get a lot more options. Double province is something I can reasonably hope to do and he still doesn't have, he can't double province next turn can he so i have like zero chance of him ending it like what can he do he probably has to do some form of yolo right which doesn't feel good he could potentially lose to a province duchy turn next time which i might be set up well to do yeah yeah this this play seems good the more i think about it All he has to do is forge province into province and buy one. We all know what Adam says, and it feels good. Do it. Uh, well, it, it depends on how many points he has, right? If he scores too many points, then... Um, I'm assuming, Mazin, you're talking about my next turn, setting up my next turn. So, And, and obviously, it depends very much on what he does. He, he was able to draw quite a bit. Uh, still not much treasure, but he is shuffling with a lot of action cards in play. Oh, he's going to draw enough treasure. So, yes, this was this was good. I haven't lost the game right now. And now he goes mad for duchies. So, uh, I have lots... I, I have... The game is winnable from this point, yeah? I can remake Forge into Province and buy a Province. That's one way I can win. I can also Forge something into a duchy and buy a... Pro no, I don't have the economy to buy a Province. I have to gain the Province. So I would have to forge into province and buy duchy. Uh, nobles just need to get played. Forging into province, how do I do that? I could forge two remakes. I can forge five and three. Those are really my only options. Yeah. And my threes are shanty towns. So I guess I have to reserve... I just have to think real hard before... Uh, I just have to think real hard before uh, playing my last shanty town in hand. So let's do this and this. That seems pretty clear. No, well, I should probably should play the rabble. Well, I need to draw more. I don't have any of my gainers. So let's just do this. There are more of these cards in my deck. Okay, let's just stop right now and check for a win, even though I'm quite certain I don't have one. Okay, I don't, so we have to do this. Okay, it all came out in the wash. This is just a, a bad draw. Yeah, this sucks. I'm pretty sure that I just have to buy a duchy here. I have two remakes now because I remade Shantytown into remake last turn. I could have done two golds into two forges. Then I would have one remake and an extra Shantytown. But I wouldn't have this gold. I don't know. Gold is very valuable to me. I think I just buy a duchy. Do I mill a duchy? I'm pretty sure I don't do that. 
I'm quite sure I don't mill a province. That's just asking to lose the game. Yeah, so this just sucks. Super bad. Okay, well, this hand starts looking much starts out looking much better than before. I didn't top deck anything bad for him, although uh, he didn't have any draw, so it's likely his turn ends here, and he should just get the province. Yeah, so it's very difficult for me to catch up now. I need to get a province and a duchy and something else. So that last turn pretty much killed me. Is that possible? It is possible. Remake Forge into Province. Remake Remake into Duchy by a state. It's it's not actually that's not crazy at all. I have like a lot of the components I need for that. And I can just play Shantytown Nobles and Rabbles pretty much with impunity at this point. So I'm not dead. It's not looking good, but I'm not dead. Hey, that's that's good to see. That may end up being very relevant. Because <laughs> I probably can't end the game this turn yet. See, I already have province and duchy. So really all I need to do is just draw two coppers or a gold, and I, and I win the game right now. Uh, so that means rabble next... Oh man, now we have to track deck. Uh, okay, so clean shuffle here. He skips gold and copper, so I have 0% chance of drawing what I need because he skipped it. Okay, I guess I knew that at the start of the turn, didn't I? This is really bad. <sighs> Oh, I also don't have the actions if I use his nobles to draw. So what do you do from here? I, I actually can't get more points. I can net a point by remaking remake into duchy and nobles into nothing. I can't remake Forge because I lose the game. I could remake Remake into Duchy, Duchy into Gold. It's pretty bad. There is a note. These are good cards in here. I shouldn't play the nobles for dead draw. The problem is I lose a remake in that play, and that's important. Uh, did you go second? I did. So do I pass? I don't know what else to do. I don't see anything at all I can do that's profitable. I guess Forge Remake into Scavenger? I mean, I got, I got nothing. Yep. draw through all of this oh 
wow! <laughs> And a state. The goal gets more and more crazy. <laughs> hey, if I draw my gold, I can get a duchy! I think I'm totally dead. And the only way I can actually add value to my deck at this point is to uh, buy things with treasure. Well, anyway, I'm toast. Time for a beggar. Yeah, that actually would have been good. Didn't matter. <laughs> GG, my head hurts. Man, there's a lot going on. That's, that's a really high skill game. If I played better in the opening, as close as it was to me being able to win. <sighs> that's frustrating. I think I want to stop playing Dominion now. <laughs>